Hey there, art lovers! Today, we're diving into the world of Arthur Hughes, a British artist from the 19th century. His life experiences and unique perspectives have greatly influenced his incredible body of work. First up, we have view from Cape Pentire, North Cornish coast, painted in 1909. Hughes captures the breathtaking beauty of the Cornish coastline, transporting us to a peaceful and serene setting. Living near the coast allowed him to deeply connect with the natural world, its power, and its tranquility. In the sluggard, market women, Brittany, France, created in 1876, we see Hughes exploring the lives of the hardworking women of Brittany. He captured their strength and resilience, giving us a glimpse into their daily struggles and triumphs. Next, we have the convent boat, painted between 1873 and 1874. Hughes takes us on a voyage to a tranquil and mysterious place. The boat symbolizes escape and the longing for freedom, a scene in Monastery Boat, created in 1880. This reflects Hughes' fascination with alternate realities and his desire for spiritual exploration. Moving on, we have a bay on the North Cornish coast, painted between 1889 and 1892. Hughes' love for the Cornish coast shines through once again, immersing us in the dramatic beauty of the surroundings. The crashing waves and rugged cliffs remind us of the untamed forces of nature. Now, let's take a look at Storm of the Crows, created in 1884. In this electrifying piece, Hughes captures the dark and mysterious side of nature, eliciting both fear and awe. This work speaks to his fascination with mythology and the supernatural. In Jack O'Lantern, painted in 1872, Hughes takes us into the world of folklore and fantasy. The mischievous jack-o'-lantern guides us through a land of enchantment and wonder, showcasing Hughes' imaginative storytelling abilities. Next, we have portrait of the Pre-Raphaelite painter William Bell Scott, created in 1886. This intimate and realistic portrayal of one of his contemporaries reflects Hughes' admiration for the Pre-Raphaelite movement and his desire to capture the essence of his fellow artists. In The Potter's Courtship, painted in 1886, Hughes explores themes of love and longing. The delicate and tender gesture between the potter and his beloved evokes a sense of romance and a desire for connection. Lastly, we have Overthrowing of the Rusty Knight, created between 1894 and 1908. This fantastical piece showcases Hughes' talent for creating whimsical and imaginative narratives. The Rusty Knight is a symbol of outdated ideals being overthrown by the unstoppable force of progress. From capturing the beauty of coastal landscapes to delving into folklore and mythology, Hughes' artwork is a glimpse into his rich imagination and deep appreciation for the world around him. So, grab your art palette and embark on this exciting journey through the art of Arthur Hughes.